Drunks, addicts, whores, the pointless dregs of the shining city of Horizon. The only difference between them and the rest of the pieces of shit who call this place home was most of them had jobs and could afford the cover to get inside the club. God, I hated this fucking city. As soon as I acquired my target, I'm headed somewhere else. Didn't matter where, I just want out. I could freelance from a better place than this. That breaks my heart. This is our home you say you hate so much. It was her. You got to be kidding me. You wanted me, motherfucker. I'm right here. I was frozen in place. Oh no you don't. That's it. Watch me. Like I have a choice? You're tense. I can help with that. What the hell? God won't save you. Not from me. My God. Somebody help me. I asked that once. They said no, so no. She won't let me kill you. That makes me unhappy. Leave well enough alone, Blake. Fuck with us again and I'll stop your heart. My god, my god, my god, my god. I hope it was good for you, Isaiah. Maybe we'll do this again. Hey, what's up, everybody? I uh, hope you enjoyed our short little uh, scene that we did there from the book KLS9. My name is Matt Whiteside, and this is Ridiculously Honest Book Reviews, um, or Honestly Ridiculous Book Reviews. I can't remember. <laughs> my name's, yeah, my name is Matt Whiteside. I already said that. No editing ever. So I had such a great time with this book. The I'm going to read, read my review of it because I feel like I did a good job <laughs> of writing it. And I had a hard time, honestly. I wanted to do this book justice by Lee Grissom, KLS9 by Lee Grissom was uh, such a fantastic book and I having a hard time put words to it. So this is my review of it. Inject, it's called Injected into a Beautifully Horrific Dream That I Didn't Want to End. Have you ever read a book and felt like someone was massaging your brain with coconut oil and chocolate? Well, that's how KLS9 was for me. What an incredibly cool, sexy, super-powered, traumatic, psychological story. It didn't just knock my socks off or blow me away. It laid me down like a feather on a bed, a bed of explosives, and kissed my wick with a nuclear bomb for lips as my mind was ignited in a fully realized future reality where most of humanity had gone to hell in a handbasket. I could feel the blood dripping from the ceiling in the government facility after the massacre. I could hear Carrie's other half howling in her mind. I could see the scars that perforated and laced the pieces of Carrie together. From being so horribly beaten and broken because of powers born to her, from being torn apart and rebuilt into a weapon for others' bidding. I felt Carrie's pain and suffering, and I watched as she kicked the living shit out of everyone and everything that hurt her. I saw her love and embrace people, even when her memory failed her. As her world was split into two, in her mind. God, I love this book. Some of the scenes had me laughing out loud, like Isaiah in the bar as Carrie messes with his mind. I think <laughs> you got to see that scene the bar as Carrie messes with his mind was pure magic amazing work by the author Lee Grissom knocked it out of the park the way you write is a fine meal to be appreciated and the deliciously edible pieces that you feed us are both rich and savory I highly recommend KLS 9 it is 300 pages of ecstasy oh in that editing or that ending <laughs> My editing's terrible. That ending. Wow. I can't wait to read the second one. I know it's out now. Um, the book blew me away. I felt like it was the most luscious <laughs> treat. And uh, I love the characters. Uh, it was fantastic. If you haven't checked out this book yet, stop goofing around. Get out there, buy the book. Second one's available now. 
it's gonna it'll blow you away it'll like i said it'll lick your wick bro and girl <laughs> check it out don't take my word for it oh yeah get out there check out kls9 it's terrifyingly amazing vivid imagery sultry sexual scenes there was psychological warfare you know carrie goes through this whole trying to find herself in the in the book trying to figure out what the hell's going on every time she uses her power she has a migraine the voice is in her head highly recommended five star review check it out available on amazon an ebook and paperback and uh believe me because i'm unbelievable thank you guys so much for watching this video if you would subscribe to the channel and hit that notification for the bell you know what we love you love it